Well, we've got Fairly Turtle Sprout on for five back, and here is another nuke. Once again, this is on Wasteland. It is a different match. Proven fact is that I was using a payload last match, I'm using a stealth bomber this match, but that's not the point. This is a follow up commentary to my previous commentary, which is about psychology. Um, we are going to. We're not going to talk about more psychology, because I'm going to save that for Wednesdays. We are going to pretty much ask to see what interests you the most about the next commentary. We can either carry on with more applied psychology and try and apply theories that I know into video gaming and stuff, or we can elaborate on the theories that we talked about or I talked about before to elaborate on the trait theory and or the catastrophe theory stuff like that or we could go into a whole new branch of psychology that this is the part of psychology I failed two years ago although technically I passed it but it isn't a pass that any university would accept ever now in terms of the commentaries we can or the types of psychology we can talk about there is cognitive psychology which is to do with your memory how you remember things um, de developmental psychology which is to do with growing up as a, a, a baby or a child and how things around you so like your parents and other social influences can affect how you grow up and how you act as an adult slash teenager However, as Castle Bravo mentioned in my previous video, as with psychology there are many con second you start categorising things you start getting contradictions and that's true for everything. And I'll give you a small example. Um, in developmental psychology, say your parents smoke that, and people say, this is just off the top of my head, this isn't from the book or anything, um, you say your parents smoke, people say you're more likely to smoke because your parents smoke. That's not true at all. Your parents might smoke, that might put you off smoking. Also, it could be friends that influence you more to smoke than your parents. And that's a contradiction and whatnot. It'll make sense when I define it in more detail when we get on to the developmental side of psychology. There is biological psycholo psychology which is to do with stress. It's actually not as interesting as it sounds because it's to do with how your immune system can fail under stress and it doesn't really outline how you become stressed. To a degree it does but not a massive degree. This is the specification breakdown for biological psychology. The body's response to stress, including some crap that I'm not going to pronounce because the likelihood is you won't have heard of it. Stress related illnesses and the immune system. Life's, life changes and daily hassles. Workplace stresses. Personality factors. The distinction between emotion focused and problem focused approaches to stress the psychological and physiological methods of stress management so it, it can be somewhat interesting um, but I wouldn't say it's the most interesting topic in the psychology specification that I have there is also social, psycho social psychology which is social influences again that doesn't really help you that much we'll go into the specification this one actually is semi interesting because it can be applied sort of modern day so the specification breakdown types of conformity including internalization and compliance explanations of why people conform including informational social influences and normative social influences Obedience, 
explanation of why people obey social influences in everyday life so explanation of independent behavior including how people resist pressures to conform and pressures to obey authority the influence to the influence of individual differences on independent behavior and implica implications for social change of research into social influence this this topic is actually more interesting i kind of i kind of enjoyed it um i enjoyed that side of psychology it does have some very interesting theories and some interesting experiments that were conducted so I would very much like to go into that one, but genuinely it's what you guys want to see and want to hear about. There's another topic actually. Um, and individual differences, so psychotherapy and abnormality. That's a semi-interesting topic as well actually, from what I remember. No, oh, it is because it, it delves quite deep into the mind and how your behaviour, how behaviour is defined. And we'll go into the specification again. Um, let's see, flip forward a page. So, for individual differences and abnormalities. Definitions of abnormality including deviation from social norms, failure to function adequately, and deviation from ideal mental health. That is a very interesting topic actually, the deviation from ideal mental health. Um, limitations associated with the definitions of psychological abnormality. The key features of the biological approach to psychopathology. The features of a psychological key features of the psychological approaches to psychopathology including the psychodynamic behavioral and cognitive approaches biological therapies including drugs and ECT psychological therapies including psychoanalysis systematic desensitization and the cognitive behavioral behavioral therapy um if you were to ask me out of the five the six we'll say seven because there's more applied psychology more in-depth explanations of theories mentioned in the previous video cognitive psychology developmental psychology stress social psychology and abnormality I'd say it would either be abnormalities the applied psychology or the detailed theories would be any of my picks but I don't know it depends what you want to know about I have a book I have the internet and I have life experience in some departments probably but, you know If possible, I will try and reference in some stuff. So like if I get a particularly informative web page, I'll link that. You can check it out. I will also add the the three theories that I talked about in the previous video, the catastrophe theory and so forth there's pictures into the next video I'll learn how to do it, don't worry but this is Tactical Nuke 254 that's the Sprite 145 a quick update on stuff and we'll see what interests you next Sprite 145 saying I'm out, peace <laughs>